when you hear a wave coming at you, it's like a giant bomb going off. You can't control Mother Nature. There's just no possible way. It's just hard to describe. I'm Ryan Moss, I'm a surf cinematographer, and I travel the world chasing waves. I'm out there a lot of the times in the waves trying to create moments that give the viewer an intimate connection with the surfer. And you can't really get those moments if you're sitting on land, on the beach, filming with a big lens. It doesn't give you that feeling of what it's like to actually be out there. Being a surf cinematographer, there's a lot of tools in my tool bag. But my favorite tool is the DJI Mavic. It's lightweight, it's compact, it can easily fit in your camera bag. The Mavic is a dream come true. Having a drone allows you to keep shooting when you can't keep swimming. It can take a lot out of you. In order to capture these moments is physically exhausting. A lot of the times you will get caught inside by a wave. And that's the worst case scenario. You're trying hard not to panic, but everything in your body and your instincts is telling you to panic. It's very dangerous. It's also very rewarding. Now that I'm older and I have the ability to go out and explore the world and have the opportunity to try to find these waves, it's a passion. You lay awake at night just dreaming about it. And so when you have the opportunity to go out and physically go on these trips, there's no length that you're not willing to go in order to find these waves. The Mavic is so small, lightweight, and compact. It can handle anything that you throw at it. I love the Mavic's intelligent flight features, such as obstacle avoidance. I'm a filmmaker, not a pilot, and I can fly confidently without having to worry about hitting a palm tree or a wall. It's not just about seeing waves all the time. It's about taking in the surroundings and being able to capture that and document it and show the actual scale of it. So my return to home feature is really important to me, where I'd otherwise be afraid to land the drone because I'm always working around water and there's a high percentage chance that I, on my own, would crash it into the ocean. It allows me to be confident that the drone itself will come back and land where it took off from. For me, the Mavic is not just a filmmaking tool. It allows me to scout new locations and allows me to find waves that I would not otherwise be able to see. And really, that just increases your chances of discovering a new wave and that's what it really is all about at the end of the day is the most important thing. The ocean has given me everything. And since I was a little kid, I just always wanted to be around it. And so having the ability to continue being around it every day means everything to me. I can't think of another life I'd ever live. And that's the dream.